Hey guys, welcome to my channel. Thanks for tuning in. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell for all new videos. Hey guys, and welcome to my channel. Thanks for tuning in today. I wanted to share this quick video with you. This is just some things I went over with myself today, and I wanted to open up and let you guys know about it. These are some words well these are some scriptures so i would say god's words that i say to myself and read to myself to know that he's with me and understand how to get through these tough battles so here are a couple of scriptures for a couple issues that i suffer from that i feel will be good to share i have really bad insomnia i tend to stay up late at night it's hard for me to go to sleep most times i have to pray to get to go to sleep because my mind wanders so much there's so much going on that i'm trying to comprehend and understand as well as heal from so when it comes to insomnia i like to go to the scripture of psalms 23 6. this one actually really helps me just get an understanding of god's word when it comes to not being able to have peace of mind to sleep addiction is another one i have um an addiction that I suffer from when it came to my past and when it comes to this addiction I tend to go to Psalms 23 5 I find that it keeps me moving forward it keeps me understanding that the journey that I am on is better than the one I was at even though both of those are a part of me it doesn't define me Another one I have are panics. I have a lot of anxiety, so it causes panic attacks. I've had those before. So I try to really zoom, zone in on meditation and like any spiritual practices that's calming, calming the mind, calming the heart, calming the body. And I also take a look at God's word. And what I mean by with God's word, God's word says that when it comes to panic, to look at John 14, 27, because John always, just gives me peace of mind with his word that he puts within the bible and how he describes how god helps you so that is a really good chapter john is as well as that scripture i gave you is good going on to grief um again i suffer from the loss of my parents so grief is a big thing for me especially through the trauma i went through with my parents in the passing and so when it comes to that grief has weighed on my heart heavily very heavily and um i go to john 1 4 7 because he describes a lot about grief and pain and heartache from grief so i really think that that's a really good scripture to look into when you're suffering from losses whether it's death or whatever you consider as a grief Another thing I have is stress. When it comes to anxiety and panicking, of course, that brings stress. It brings stress on the body. body. And um, it just really causes me a lot of stress. So then I can become very shut down-ish. So I like to go to this scripture here, which is Galatians 3.26, because in Galatians 326 it helps me understand more in depth of how to really tune in and figure out what i'm stressed about and how to reach for god's hand and god's word to get out of it last but not least guys is social withdrawn i don't discuss this much but i am a very introverted person and i'm not very friendly with meeting others so stepping out of my box is a lot for me and i think the reason why i don't have a um reason of or social withdrawn is because due to the past trauma and hurt from others i've shut myself down and went into a hiding place of not letting people in and knowing me so social withdrawn so reading these scriptures have helped me to open up more and understand where my social withdrawn has come from um basically who started the trauma and how to move forward with God's word with healing. And one of the scriptures that I use for healing is Psalms 18 and 31. All right, guys, I hope you liked that quick video on some of God's words when it comes to going through different crises in life and different situations. There are more. If you want me to share more, I'll be happy to. These are the ones that I go to for my issues currently. And as I develop and more issues come, there will also be more scriptures. And I'll share those with you too. Have a great day.